Hi everybody, I am Buck, WSR Weezer, helping you put the do into do-it-yourself. And our do-it-yourself project today has, is, involves this uh, snapper lawn tractor. It's a pretty cool machine. And it's got an 11 horsepower Briggs & Stratton single cylinder Intec engine. And I believe it's got a blown head gasket. So what I want to do today is talk you through the symptoms of a blown head gasket and then I want to walk you through the steps to repair it. So let's get started. Give you a closer look at this tractor. This has a date code of 03. So I think this is a model, this Intec engine is a model from 2003. I think this is in the original engine. So the tractor dates back to that, that uh, year, I think. So it's about 16 years old. And uh, let's talk through the symptoms of a blown head gasket. The first uh, symptom, and I'm not going to fire it up for you, you're just going to take my word for it. it, has to do here with the muffler. When this thing's running, it's blowing out smoke. So oil is somehow making its way into the combustion chamber. So blowing smoke. Number two, here around the cylinder head, there's evidence of oil leaking. That's symptom number two around the valve cover and around the cylinder head, oil leaking. Symptom number two. Symptom number three is fouled up spark plug. A lot of oil and grime on this spark plug and a lot of built up carbon deposits on the tip. Probably a lot of carbon deposits and build up inside that combustion chamber as well. And then the third, or I mean the fourth symptom of our blown head gasket, after you shut the engine down, pull the dipstick, you get smoke coming out of the out of the crankcase, exhaust gases, exhaust smoke, out of the dipstick tube. So you might be experiencing some or all of these symptoms, as am I, and I think the problem is gonna be a blown head gasket. So now it's time to get to work on changing it out. 